Hey, look at this, I made a time machine. But I don't need this to explain general relativity as Albert Einstein himself saw in 1915. General relativity is a geometric theory of gravity that develops special theory of relativity. This theory postulates that gravitational forces that are caused by the deformation space-time itself and inertial forces are of the same nature. Let's imagine the elevator calmly descends, but suddenly the cables break and inside there is a man, his name is Adam. For a time, both the elevator and Adam have no weight and are in free fall under the influence of gravity. This is called the equivalence principle. An amazing fact, the first consequence of the principle of equivalence, light under the influence of gravity, must bend. Imagine that this blanket is our space, this big ball is our sun, this small ball is our earth, and now let's show the big ball first. As we can see, our space is warped by the mass of this big ball. And now let's show the ball even smaller. It will roll in a curve around the larger ball just as the earth turns around the sun because of its pushing by the curvation of space. That's why sunlight reaches us in 8 minutes. It's all about the curvature of space-time. One of Einstein's key experiments was to compare a photograph of the sky taken during an eclipse with the same section of the sky taken at night in order to show a slight distortion of the position of stars near the sun. Using the principle of equivalence, he calculated the deflection of starlight by the sun and his final result showed 1.7 arc seconds. In 1919, Arthur Eddington led an expedition to observe the solar eclipse and test Einstein's theory. And you know what? Eddington found an average deviation of 1.61 arc seconds, which coincided with Einstein's predictions. The second key experiment is the effect of gravity on the frequency of the light beam. When a ray of light emitted by the sun moves away from it, Gravity must slow it down and cause it to lose energy. So, the frequency of yellow sunlight will decrease and the ray, moving away from the gravitational attraction of the sun, will become redder. In other words, it will create a redshift. Albert Einstein's general theory of relativity was and remains the most important discovery that changed our view of the universe forever. So, let's join the science and together we will open the new horizons.